Hi viewers, welcome to our YouTube channel Electrical Lectures. In this video, I will be showing you how to write mathematical equations in Microsoft Word in LaTeX style. Although MS Word offers equation editor through which you can write variety of mathematical equations, but there is a very serious problem that whenever you are going to write an equation, you need to find that particular symbol or style from a group of symbols and possible options to write the equation. But, but there exists a very easy way to write mathematical equation and in this video I will be telling you that method. First of all, let us insert an equation by pressing Alt and Equal at the same time. This will insert an equation. Now, For example, I want to write Greek letters, Alpha, Beta and Gamma. So instead of finding those symbols and letters from this set of symbols provided by the equation editor, I will simply type backslash alpha and press space. So you see it is converted into alpha. Similarly, I write beta and press space. So the main point is you write the name of that Greek word and type backslash before typing the Greek word or any command. Similarly, or gamma and press space. So this is how you can write Greek letters. Similarly, you can also write these Greek letters in capital as well. Just insert an equation by pressing Alt and equal to sign. Now I will write capital alpha. So just replace this small a with capital A and press space. This is capital alpha. It is similar to A and then capital beta just replace b with capital b and then press space similarly or gamma so you see you can write such kind of capital greek letters now we move on to writing some complicated mathematical equations for example if i want to write an integral how would i write it here so first of all again insert equation and i write here y is equal to now i am i want to write an integral so backslash i and t this is the command for integral underscore then i will place the lower limit for example it is zero and then the upper limit if it is infinity so that will be i n f t y and space so you see here is the integral and inside integral i can write for example x square so that is x power 2 and press space it is square and then dx so this is your integral now let us write for example a cosine so x is equal to cos space and here i will write 2 and for example for pi i will write 2 pi and space it will be converted to pi the greek letter and then let's say it is y so that is cosine in a similar way you can also write any other mathematical equation. For example, if we are interested in find writing uh, an equation containing the summation, so that will be again by using similar procedure. So h is equal to for summation, we will write backslash sum and the lower limit after underscore that is, for example, 1 and the upper limit is let's say capital K. So you see. This is the converted summation and inside summation, for example, I want to write minus 1 raised to power k. So that is your equation. And now for writing a fraction, you will simply need to write it like this. y is equal to, let's say 1 over 2, I will write 1 divided by and press space. And in the denominator, you will simply write 2. Now, if you want to write something by using relational operators, you can also do it. Insert an equation. Let's say you want to write A belongs to B. So here is A or belongs to, I will write this N and here is B. So it is A belong to B. Also, you can write inequalities by using this syntax. Let's say I want to write X greater than or equal to Y. So it is X. Or greater than or equal to I will write GEQ and this is Y. Similarly, 
x for less than or equal to that is l e q and it is y if i want to write not equal to then it will be x n e q and y so this is how you can write variety of mathematical equations without using the equation editor of ms word this method is very helpful in writing the mathematical equations in ms word in a quick manner thank you for watching this video stay tuned to our channel electrical lectures